Welcome to Jank Play TCG. My name's Landon, and here we play Jank. And today is the final day of Dolphin Punch. Um, Palfin has been a fantastic deck. I'm super excited to play it physically. Probably, um, at the time you're watching this, I played it yesterday. Yeah, and, uh, probably. Depending on if the cards show up or not. But, uh... Yeah, jump in the Discord, ask me how it went, and all that stuff. I I really like this deck. It's just so much fun, and it's kooky. You know, it's so jank. I love it. Absolutely, absolutely love it. Um, and I hope it can go out on a win. Uh, King of it was unfortunately not able to go uh, the distance. And uh, Palafin still isn't getting a uh, perfect... You know, it's not going 4-0, but maybe maybe it could go 3-0, 3-1, I mean. And with Fire Sleeves, I'm a little hopeful, you know? Uh, they might be playing Fire Pokemon and hitting for weakness. Maybe we can do it. Although a lot of Fire decks currently are um, actually Charizard, and Charizard uh, EX is not weak to water, so... It might be a little bit of a race then, so we'll we'll have to see. But Manaphy is their starting Pokemon, which does hurt our Jet Punch capabilities, but um, maybe we'll still figure something out. All right, so I'm going to put Cletha out, and I'm going to Professor's Research. Just discard, draw a whole new hand. We even get a Zubat. We get a Nest Ball for another Zubat. Perfect. And we get a Water Energy, so I can Valiant Evolution. And get things going. We will put Cleffa in the active. And we will evolve up. Perfect. That's what I want. That's exactly what I want. <laughs> Alright. So what is my opponent going to do? Barry. Draw three cards. Okay. Maybe people are finally starting to see that drawing three cards is not necessarily a terrible thing, you know? So Charmander does come out. That does mean we will probably be seeing Charizard eventually. An Arceus V comes out. Ooh, that might be interesting. Arceus V. Okay, and they put an energy on Arceus V. Now, Arceus V can only power up other Pokemon V. So they're clearly not expecting to be able to power up EX or... A uh, non rule box Pokemon here. Uh, Ultra Ball coming out. Okay, that's going to give us a lot of information. I don't know, and Super Rod have been discarded, meaning they probably have some other draw. They might even have some evolution sitting in their hand, and uh, because they're getting rid of Super Rod. So, what are they grabbing with Ultra Ball? Charizard EX. That tells me a lot. They've got rare candy. That is exactly what that tells me. Rare candy and some other draw. So, okay. Interesting. Hmm. It's our turn. We draw water energy and nothing else. Really? Nothing else? Uh, I am going to go ahead and boss up the Charmander here. And we're going to retreat into Palafin. Who will be doing um, Justice Kick for 420 damage just because. I can't do Jet Punch. I would love to Jet Punch that little guy. Uh, <laughs> jet Punch that little guy. But the Manaphy is stopping me. So, yeah. Um, but we are now in a situation. We've got Raihans in hand, right? And uh, if they do KO Palafin, I'm fairly confident we can get another one going here. But what are they going to do? It's one of those things. They have so many options. And they're taking none of them. Cool. Uh, we will just go ahead and Great Ball then. Great Ball gets us Golbat. Golbat will let us draw two more cards. Uh, which could be fun. So let's go ahead and draw those. Discreet draw. One, two. Escape Rope. And some water energy. Man, we are just cooking right now. So we're going to escape or force the Arceus into the active. So now we can retreat into the Palafin 
and we're going to justice kick this thing. It will survive with 10 hit points, but it's only 10. I can jet punch it next turn, even though I won't be able to hit the Manaphy on the bench or whatever they're putting on the bench. It's still worthwhile, right? Charmander. Yep, they're still trying to get that thing going. Okay. If we top deck a boss's orders, I'm going to laugh. You know I'm going to laugh. I'm going to laugh. What do we top deck here? Just a water energy. Okay. 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 That's fine. Jet punch. Kabam. Oh. Uh, there. It will be shielded. Anyways. So. We get two prizes though. We are now three prizes ahead. Which, uh, overall is a good thing. Oh. Only two prizes. Come on, Landon. Um. Cleffa and Finism. Not cards I was hoping for. But. They're a welcome surprise. Uh, Charmander goes into the active because they already got the rare candy. They got the Charizard EX. We know this. Charizard hits the field. We will be jet punching it next turn. So, uh, prepare yourselves for that. But, uh, yeah. Okay. Yep, there's the... All three energy onto Charizard because you've got nothing else going on. Got it. Should have buried first then. You could have buried, drawn three cards... And uh, maybe you have drawn into a basic to put some energy on. Or maybe not. I don't know. You haven't played a basic down yet. Path to the Peak comes down. We do not use any rule box Pokemon. So that's completely fine by me. Cleffa into the active retreat, of course. Your turn. Vengeful Punch comes out. We're going to play that down there. We're going to play Finizen down. We're going to play another Cleffa down because why the heck not? Super Rod, Finizen, Palafin, uh, Golbat, or Water Energy? Golbat. Yeah, we'll, we'll do that one. And we will Raihan some Water Energy onto Finizen. We will grab a Palafin. We got three of them in deck. Good to know. Good thing I recovered one. Um, play that down. We're even going to put this second water energy on a Finizen. We are down to almost no cards in hand, but we're going to kick Charizard. Kabamo! 210 damage. It is so close to being KO'd. We just need a Palafin next turn, and we can take another two prizes. That'll be pretty nice. Pretty nice. Um, and what can my opponent respond with? It seems like they aren't drawing enough off those berries to really work out for them. They've got 80 HP remaining. Oh, man. This is so nice. I mean, it's Charizard, you know. But it's also, like, Charizard, you know. Like, it's... Uh. Alright, so Raihan, Palafin. The, the, the biggest uh, worry I have right now is that we do not have another attacker or pre-evolution to an attacker ready to go. Can my opponent get something ready? Maybe. I don't know. But one, two. But I'm concerned that we don't have anything. So we get a Zubat and a Palafin. Still, nothing much going on beyond that. If they do KO Palafin this turn, we're most likely just going to be using Kleffa to draw some cards, and that's going to give us two prizes. We got to discard a Kleffa. No problem. Gladly. Well, not gladly, but you know what I mean. We got two free retreaters on the bench. I'm not too concerned. We even got Goldbat with an energy attached to it if we do need to retreat something. Nope. Okay. Um, yeah, we had pretty good luck with like that boss's orders to KO the Charmander, slow them down that way. The Arceus not evolving or getting powered up and being able to KO that. And then the Charizard just being a nice one-two punch and we're donezo with that. So overall, that was pretty smooth for Palafin. Although near the end, I was worried that we were running out of gas and there wasn't enough in the tank to get us the full victory. I was glad to be proven wrong there and hey we took down Charizard the big card of the latest set so and I mean Charizard EX technically is not weak to water but you know there was 
weakness didn't really play that big of a part in it but you know it was still there um so yeah thank you to my opponent for putting up such a great match uh wish they could have drawn better barry maybe not the best draw of course i still like to draw the draw three but i like it more on crowbat than i do as your supporter for the turn so yeah uh barry not drawing enough cards for my opponent in order to stay in the game and palafin just taking it and running with it thank you so much for watching go ahead and like this video subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out whatever deck i build for next week and check out the discord where we've got some awesome deck builders and uh just a real fun community and so it's a lot of fun check it out it's awesome and of course until next time keep playing jank <laughs>